Just going to have a real quick look at this fern held bulkhead uh, replacement for 16 watt 2D. Um, fern held being the brand, and they're actually quite a good brand, but this is one of their cheaper fittings. Uh, it's 11 watts as opposed to 16. I'm just going to have a van look at this, so it's not going to be very well done. So, opal diffuser, obviously, prismatic is pretty much useless with LED now. Uh, three toggle clips so that you can undo it. Push it in with a screwdriver. And inside you have a gear tray with 35 LED chips. Um, it's metallic, feels metallic for heat dissipation. And on the back is three push fit connections, live neutral earth, and driver unit, which is 500 milliamps. Can I focus? If I don't want to focus. Come on, focus. Tap the screen. Focus. There we go. 500 milliamps, 265 volts, or 110 to 265 in. So you can, this is, uh, can be used in America, I guess. Um, cable entry in the back. I've uh, got the two uh, screw, uh, two bits. Oh, I can't speak. Two molded uh, things near the outside so you can fill it on beezer boxes easily. And apart from that, you've got plenty of other holes, places you can drill, come in. It's spaced off so you can bring your cables in, terminate behind. Uh, I've done some van maths, uh, if anyone's interested. Um, 11 watt, 35 LEDs, driven at 500 milliamps, gives you 14.28 milliamps per LED, so it's slightly under driven to prolong the life of the LED chips. And compared to its uh, 16 watt rival, uh, not, not factoring in losses in the ballast or the choke or or the driver itself, um, if this 11 watt fitting was left on 8 hours a day for 365 days a year, so in an office environment, I know obviously offices close for holidays and things, you'd be looking at using 32.1 kilowatts and the 16 watt rival will be using 46.7 kilowatts. So that is quite a difference over the year used for 8 hours a day. Um, was going to put actually 16 watt ballasts in at this job, um, but the Fern Howard LED um, version was actually one pound dearer, which is uh, not bad. It means they're really getting into the market now, the LED fittings, and uh, obviously pretty much maintenance free once the ballast or the uh, LED chips start going, then that is it, you buy a new fitting. So thank you for watching. Uh, I'm going to put up a couple of photos when I've finished, uh, before and after, because these go in a, in a sort of loo area. Well, in the end, it weren't too bad. Had to fight the uh, kitchen uh, the floor layers to get the lights in, which isn't too bad. I had to shimmy around one door to get into that door. Do me others. These are star flues, anyways. And two more lights in there. Yeah, not bad. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, comment, rate. See you in my next video.